so today we're gonna be talking about new moisturizer it is a 2019 and I want to reveal a brighter smoother me and so I've been trying for a couple of uh, weeks on and off um, lately I've been very persistent with this moisturizer um, I wanted to talk to you guys to Shiseido's this is a bioperformance glow revival this glow revival moisturizer it's um, it looks very fancy. It looks like a little bit too as an opening, I want to say. Like, um, I don't know, like a spatial uh, mobile device or like a spatial car for somebody in the air. Like, I could totally see this floating, of course. Um, it has a very nice and fancy um, container. Um, it has the Shiseido logo on the top of it. You can see actually all of my lightning over there, but the Shiseido logo will be right here. And it also, this one is the one with the 1.7 ounces. Um, I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit more about the pricing, of course. So the 1.7 retails for $108 and then the 2.5 retails for $128. So basically for $20 more dollars, you will be getting more than half, um, on, uh, like on a regular one so this is a 1.7 it was $108 uh, it's uh, 50 milliliters mm, once it's open it should be good for a whole year uh, like I said I've been using this on and off and lately I've just been sticking with it because it, it's very good it's very moisturizing I'm um, gonna talk to you a little bit more about what's going on you know uh, this is a new year new year new me so hello how you doing how you doing? So I want to talk, talk to you guys a little bit more about this moisturizer. Um, this moisturizer, it says online that reveals beautiful even skin tone. Um, it also helps you with uh, glowing um, skin and diminishes the appearance of the wrinkles, uh, fine lines, dullness, and redness. So I want to say for somebody who has rosacea or just have redness, this one will be very calming for you guys. And somebody who is looking to target many things at once, like you can target pores, you can target texture, you can target uh, mainly glow. Um, I'm gonna say that this will be the this will be the moisturizer for you. Now I am 29 years old. I am I used to be very dry skin before I even had like, eczema, like dry, really dry patches. With the continuous use and change of a skincare routine and being able to like have chemical peels and peels overall, uh, my change my skin changed a lot. So and of course it. it it's not only about the skin, it's also about what you eat or drink. I'm not sponsoring anything, but this is the Suja Organic Kombucha. Um, I like kombuchas overall. They help me to detox my my organism, my, my body overall. Um, this one is in the berries. This is my favorite. You can find them in Costco. It's like $12 for like 12 of them. So basically like a dollar or something like that. But going back to the glowing one. So this one right here, it is, a, again, Shiseido. So what makes, to me, Shiseido different? Uh, Shiseido makes it different for me. Um, I'm not married to the brand. I'm, I'm still pry, trying other items from other brands because I want to know what's a tea in it. But overall, uh, when it comes to Shiseido, I want to say that Shiseido gives me... Uh, it delivers what it promises most of the times. Um, there's only one product that really didn't do, do it for me, which was a mask. It's a clear mask, and I've done a review about it a whole year, like a whole year ago. I made a review about it. I wasn't crazy about it. I finished it up and even I, I tossed it away. But overall, Shiseido has improved my skin with not only radiance, but also with, of course, um, the texture of my skin, it gives me very natural hydration, a natural glow, it smooths up my skin. This moisturizer, excuse me, it says it's creamy, velvety, it lifts your skin dewy and supple. It says that it uh, has super bio hyaluronic acid, which is just mainly going to attract the hydration from the whole environment to your skin so you don't feel dry at all. And then it says within one week, you should feel your skin more even tone. And then within one month, you'll see more radiance, more hydration, moisturizing, and you'll see the wrinkles be like smoother and supple. Um, I want to say that this it was based on 110 women 
and this was um, information was grabbed from uh, either Shiseido and as well as Macy's.com because you guys know I love to shop at Macy's. Um, overall, this is the Shiseido Bio Performance Low Revival. So I'm going to talk to you about my experience with it now. So you can tell I'm almost halfway through it. It has a plastic container in, in the inside. Um, a lot of people have, again, the misconception, and I've heard many people that I work with and that I used to work with before too, that have the misconception that Shiseido is about skin bleaching. It is not about skin bleaching. It's, Shiseido wants you to get the best of the best, wants to have a very, very radiant glowing skin, wants to have a smoother, younger looking. So they are gonna target different things. They have a line for pores and texture. They have a line for glow which is this one they have a line for lift and firming and they have like an um the future solution selects which i have also made reviews on that one before um so i want to say that they target many different uh concerns when it comes to your skincare routine and overall I'm, i have been very satisfied with this one so this one it says that it's velvety i'll tell you what what it means velvety to me so that's what it looks like you you look like it has a very natural scent of a moisturizer like the scent it reminds me of those avon products back in the day um it has like just a scented perfume in it uh it's not irritant so for somebody who's sensitive i would rather you choose and go to either macy's or any other um store that you like and get a sample so um this is what it looks like i'm just gonna spread it all over and you guys know that I'm, I'm a, you know, I don't want to be meant to be or sound any rude, but I'm a sucker when it comes to very gel-based um, moisturizing lotions. And this one didn't take, doesn't take that long to be, uh, for my skin to um, drink it up or absorb it. Overall, it's a very, very nice um, gel-based texture. It is not like full gel, like the Clinique Dramatically Hydrating Jelly. Um, or even the ID. It's not as watery, it's not as runny, it is not as uh, hydrating when it comes to the consistency. I want to say it, is, it tends to be, to be a gel, but a little bit up there. It still has that moisture in it. Uh, so it's, it sells the whatever you put on, on, on the bottom. Like let's say I layer my products in the morning. I usually use my um, Corres serum and then my vitamin C. This is uh, from the brand Malibu. I'm almost halfway through it. And uh, stick to the review, which is coming soon. Um, so I want to say that I, I put this two first in the morning, and then I go ahead and use this one to seal in. Um, I always do this one too, two pumps. So basically, this will be my skincare routine. Uh, to I grab one pump of my regular serum, which is gonna help me enhance the benefits of whatever I use uh, next. And then I use my vitamin C, and then I use my Clinique ID just to hydrate. I let it sink in. I do this. It does look like many steps, but it's not as many because I just use them. And when I apply them, I put my clothes in it. I make sure I, I you know, I clean my teeth, my, my brush them, um, or I'm cooking at the moment in the mornings, um, usually in a rush. Um, and then I let them sink in, and then I come back and, get, and apply either my, I usually apply my gel. Um, from uh, the eye, Pandex Eye Stick, which is, this one is from Tony Molly. I just rub a little bit around my eyes, and then I go ahead and use the Clinique Pepsar. So that's what I do. And then after that, I use a little bit, just like the portion that I showed you on my hand, I use it in here. So velvety to me means that it's just gonna be um, quenching and drenching and hydrating and jelly. Um, it's not gonna be feel or feel thick. It's not oily, so I want to say that this one will be more targeted for somebody who is combo or normal to oily, um, and they still get the uh, moisture in it. Somebody who's more dry probably is going to fall in love with it, but definitely they want to do another one hydrating, not necessarily, but because this one is more gel-based, I want to say that you can, anybody from uh, leaning to the oily one is probably going to like it a little bit better. Um, it all depends to you because a lot of people may feel like this one it's a heavy moisturizer. I don't feel like it is. I just feel like it's very hydrating. Again, it soaks into my skin right away. Feels really good. This is one of the uh, one of those moisturizers that I would say that overall in the 2018 to 2019 will be one of my best moisturizers. 
because they feel very hydrating and I've noticed different changes in my skin. I do see more glow. So when I apply moisturizing, or, uh, when I, excuse me, when I apply foundation on top of this, it just looks very radiant. It doesn't look dull like it usually would. Um, this one has been improving my skin overall. Previously, I was using the Essie Lauder uh, Renew Trip. That one just didn't make the cut for me. I felt like my skin was a little bit more on the drier side. Um, I didn't see any glow specifically. And overall, I want to say that this one has been really, really good. Now, I do want to tell you a little bit more about the Shiseido line. So, also, um, while I was doing Renew Trip at night sometimes, I was using the Glow Revival in the morning because I put the makeup on top. Uh, now, I am also using, so this is the Shiseido Glow Glow Revival. And then, so at night, I've been using now um, the, <laughs> this is the, the Shiseido Bio Performance Advanced Super Restoring Cream. So this is kind of like the lifting and moisturizing cream. As you can tell, I just got a little bit. I'm, I, I'm not that crazy just yet about it because I'm still enjoying a lot my Glow Revival. They both look kind of similar. So if you want to know a little bit more about this one, stay tuned because I'm going to be posting a video about this one. And overall, I want to say that I just really enjoy my skincare routine now. I feel like in my skin, it's not where I want it to be, but it's really, really close where I wanted it to be. Um, I want to say if you're looking for a glow, this is the best moisturizer that you want to try. Just because, honestly, it delivers the benefits right away. You can tell in your skin texture, it's very smooth. You don't see as much as the fine lines in the forehead. A lot of people don't realize that, but it is very important to me and might be for you. So with all this being said, guys, I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and please let me know how you guys doing. What did you guys have uh, in mind to do in this 2019? And how do you guys like this overall look? Hope with all this being said, hope you guys like this channel and subscribe and give it a thumbs up. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.